People gathered outside the Waukesha County Courthouse today waiting for the jury's decision. CBS 58's Yukari Nakayama is live with a look at what those people were saying when the verdicts were read. Yukari. Yeah, that's right, Bill. It was an emotional day here outside of the court as we spoke to people who had just heard the verdict. Those community members here from Waukesha saying that justice was served today. A tense but gratifying day for the Waukesha community. Justice! <laughs> justice has been served. Community members with ties to the Waukesha Christmas Parade tragedy victims were present at court today. Lori Hoagland says she lost three of her friends, Tamara Durand, Jane Coolidge, and Jackson Sparks. It was a brief moment of relief, but then all the pain comes back. All the pain comes back. In and outside of the courtroom described as tense and packed. I actually couldn't get in. I was, there was overflow. It, it was full. I was in the hallway outside. Troy Burke says he was at the Christmas parade when tragedy struck. He describes the reaction of the victims and families when the guilty verdicts were read. There were so many counts, you know, the, the first few, there was, I think, more emotion and then, and then um, at the end when, you know, when they were naming the victims' names, that, that was quite emotional. To hear. All community members say the Waukesha community has been there for one another. If we just hold each other up and help each other when we can. Now those community members say that now the Waukesha community can focus on healing. Back to you guys in the studio.